What is going on guys? Welcome back to my YouTube page. I've got something completely different for you today. Behind me, a 1994 SRI out of Winfield. So what we're gonna be doing is making a few changes to this thing. First thing we're gonna do, because none of the doors work, it's uneven, it's not level, we're gonna roll it back. We're gonna dig out the existing mud, clay, whatever's under there, and then put in a proper gravel pad, move it back to where it is, tear down the deck, we're gonna build a new deck. That'll probably be one segment. And then the real time warp happens. We're going inside this thing. It's original from 1994, the year the Canucks made it to game seven in the Stanley Cup finals. Not a good day for all of us in BC here. But anyways, we're gonna redo everything on the inside. Floors, paint, paint the cabinets. I mean, nothing too crazy, nothing structural, but just a facelift, a lipstick and rouge as they say. So after that's done, we're coming back outside. We've ordered some railings for the deck, but they're back ordered. Those will go on last and a canopy on the far side. So first things first, let's tear down the deck. How do you feel about it, buddy? Good. New deck, two feet wider, five feet longer. Zip it, Rue. Yeah, we gotta keep them. Can you put that back on? Shut up. Sam's going for a little ride. The thing we had to do with this was slide it back. You can see, see there's those steel beams right here. Let me get close up. Steel beam sitting on this roller right here so they pushed it back 14 feet because when this originally came in in 1994 they've already done some work to the ground but when it came in in 1994 they kind of just put it down on uneven mud a um, little bit of clay whatever was sitting there whereas now we'll put it on to three-quarter minus crushed gravel about a foot base pack that down so that it doesn't move around um, before we do anything on the inside, we want to make sure we've got a good base to work with. So, Mounts Construction is coming back today. They're going to do the gravel pad. Then Ken's going to come in, slide that forward on the steel beams back to where it was. He's going to skirt it, and then he's going to get started on the deck. Look at what we got going on here. They scrape this all back see the pile of dirt that was in there it's kind of just like got a bit of clay in it soft moved around a bunch so it wasn't working house was always going up and down so they've scraped that all back and now they're bringing in gravel and then we're going to compact it so that house isn't going to move at all here he comes with another load now this what you want under a house look at that that's perfect they're gonna tamp this down so it's good and solid and Kenny's gonna get up under there right there roll it back over 14 feet and then we'll start putting this thing back together but it's looking nice look at this payload Gonna need a bigger truck. <laughs> well, went in town to get some supplies and missed the entire rollover, so I might as well just end this video right now because that was gonna be the meat and potatoes of the thing. Um, anyways, as you can see, they've rolled it forward. They've got it on blocks there. The pad is prepped for the deck and they're just starting the skirting. It's now the morning of day four and it's starting to look like something. The deck is almost done and it is beefy. Can have a huge party on that thing and it's not going anywhere. 
So they're gonna start working pretty quick here, get the decking done, get the steps done, and they're gonna be done for the deck because we've got another guy coming to do the railings. And then what we're gonna do, while we wait for that because the railings are back ordered, is move inside and get to work on the interior of this thing because it hasn't been touched since 1994. So as you can imagine, it is due for a facelift. Okay, the guys are all packed up. They hit the road. Let me tell you, come on, Ru. Let me tell you, they did an amazing job on this thing. Let's check it out. Here we go. First steps on the new deck. Two feet wider, five feet longer, and sturdy as something that's very, very sturdy. Telus cord running down the middle. If only I knew somebody that could handle that. So what we're gonna have is a canopy that goes from about there all the way down to the end. A little extra shade for those who want a little extra shade. And seating area here. Then down here, what we've got is my workbench where I'm gonna be frying up my world famous burgers. Going back this way, you best believe before the railings go on, you're gonna see me come flying out that door directly into the lake. So if you happen to live in Northern Alberta and you're in the market for a new deck, hit me up because this is amazing and I know just the guy that can get it done for you. That is all I've got for this week. Next week, I've got a new house coming in Countryside, so I'm gonna cover that. And we're starting the interior renovation of this 1994 SRI out of Winfield. So that'll be interesting. We'll do a before and after and maybe a little bit of during as well. So check back for that. But until then, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.